Adopting additive manufacturing is a complex process. There's no manual to guide you through it. That's why we introduced our three-phase model to illustrate the major steps. No matter what phase you're in, Mindware Advisors can help you tackle the priority challenges and advance towards your AM goals. Let's illustrate the second phase, experiment. This is the stage for research and development when businesses run a series of tests and investigations to ensure their project is not only technically feasible, does the part work as intended, but that it is also commercially viable. Is the business case convincing? As an example, let's take a look at our work with Qualical. This Italian company provides innovative solutions for the lime industry. Their team already completed the explore phase and identified a suitable application for 3D printing a shaft level indicator. This device has the critical task of measuring and balancing the amount of limestone material available at any time in the production process. The promise of AM for this application was that it could improve the performance, the size and the weight of the device, leading to potential savings of up to 20,000 US dollars per year. The challenge now was to turn this into a reality by deciding on the most suitable 3D printing method and material for the application before creating the optimal design. That's why Qualical came to the Mindware experts. We began this process by laying out the requirements of the part. Here, we needed a material that resists high temperatures, avoids oxidation issues and is ideally lighter than the previous model. When Qualical came to us, they were using a part made from sheet metal. However, we ruled out metal 3D printing as the part size made it too expensive on this occasion. As durability was crucial for this part, it made sense to consider fuse deposition modeling or FDM. The wide range of polymers traditionally used in FDM are known for their strength and are often used in heavy industry. However, this method would require the additional removal of support structures, which costs money and time, meaning it would not be commercially viable here. We decided that a combination of selective laser sintering and polyamide with a dedicated smoothing degree was a perfect solution, as we knew it would meet both technical and commercial requirements for this project. Because we switched from traditional metal manufacturing to additive plastic printing, we had to rethink the entire design to unlock AM's full potential. First, we had to ensure the plastic would be strong enough to carry the weight of the components without being overly heavy. To overcome this challenge, we implemented a honeycomb structure throughout the entire shell, making it strong, but light. But we had to go beyond these typical design benefits to meet the strict requirements of the lime industry. For example, the shaft level indicator had to withstand one bar for one hour, losing less than 10% pressure in this time frame. Otherwise, production would come to a standstill. That meant the housing and lid had to be leak-proof. To make sure of that, we tested various designs for the lid itself. After each digital design iteration, we printed the part and performed fitting and pressure tests, which measured air leakage. In the final lid design, we introduced front to back screws, something that would not be possible with traditional manufacturing. This concept tightened the lid and allowed us to meet the final air leakage criterion. In the end, we had a sturdy and durable tool that performed much better than the previous model. Not only could it thrive in a heavy industry environment, but we also reduced the size by half while distributing the strength throughout the unit. It takes a special set of skills and knowledge to design an optimal 3D printed part, especially when it comes to a heavy duty tool such as this. That's why consulting with experienced 3D printing designers and engineers is so crucial. Too many times we've seen organizations waste resources by committing to a material or technology too soon or not creating a design that is optimized to take full advantage of the benefits of additive manufacturing. Companies can only truly know they've made the right choice by testing and validating as we did with Qualical, preferably with unbiased 3D printing experts. Eager to learn how Mindware can help you future-proof your business? Get in touch with our experts today.